Hello and welcome back to more and Forever Across the Second Dimension, where last episode we explored the Gnome Village and helped to free the dimension from the wrath of the gnomes. And today we'll be facing off against another boss battle, and I recommend that you play as Perry the Platypus. Well, I mean, I guess you can play as either Perry the Platypus or uh, Pinky the Chihuahua, because both of them have the Carbonator as their favorite weapons, and the Carbonator is the most effective weapon at taking down this next boss. So we're going to get some classic Agent P and Agent Pinky action for this, for this level. On any other day, I would consider a giant cube of fur odd. But seeing as we've escaped from the Guzim already, I would label this as commonplace. Perhaps even hackneyed. Alright, so this boss is pretty easy. What you have to do is basically, whenever he charges, uh, you need to trick him into charging into one of the many objects around the area. So, uh, for instance, there was, a, there was a, a little rock structure, the base of what used to be a house that we uh that we've got him to charge into and then once he once you trick him into charging into that then he will of course uh he'll he'll be stunned temporarily and then you can just use the carbonator to drain his health very quickly we, he, like he's already down to half health and barely even begun if you at any point get sucked into the mouth and just jump out of the uh jump out of the stomach and then use a ninja glove to wall jump your way out of it like this then jump onto the uvula the dangly thing at the back of his throat that looks like a weak spot <laughs> And then shake the Wii Remote to, uh, to make your way out. And just like that, we've already drained all of the Guzim's health. It's, it's very, very easy. And we've been sucked in once again. No worries. Once again, all we have to do is just swim up to the top, grab the Ninja Glove, and then uh, wall jump our way out. It's, like I said, I, th I think it's just because we've upgraded the Carbonator so much. I already knew it was called the Uvula. That this boss is so easy, but if you just use the Carbonator, whether or not it's upgraded, it'll still be a, a, a walk in the park for you. Like, he, he, he literally has no health right now. Really make him charge off the edge. Yeah, once you, uh, once his health is drained, he'll just charge off the edge and that'll be the boss defeated. Very, very simple. You think he's okay? I'm sure he is. Villains always come back in the sequel. Well, team, I have just finished redirecting that Guzim portal in front of you. It now leads right to our secret headquarters underneath the city. Simply hop through. And that's it. Yep, that's the boss battle. Like I said, very, very easy. Significantly easier compared to the gelatin boss battle from the gelatin dimension. And we don't have any coins to play, so we can't play the crane game. We can't play parry ball. But I am going to go to the next level just to show you guys the cutscene. Okay, Candice, you are back online. And the rest of the team just got here. Took you guys long enough to collect that power. We need to strike now. Doofin Schmertz has just left in the other dimensionator. Actually, I, I just arrived. Hello, back here. We need to hit the Norbot Robot Factory first. It should be easy since without a Doofenshmirtz to command them, they are sitting decks. Hey, I'm right here. I'm Heinz Doofenshmirtz, evil scientist, right here. Am I invisible? Not you, the other Doofenshmirtz. The real evil one. The successful one. Hey, I'm plenty evil. Remember when I cut in line when we were going to that portal? Huh? Okay, so are we off to this robot factory? You guys are. I've got to head elsewhere. We've located a new device, and I'm going to commandeer it. No problem. How do we get there? You know, I'm plenty evil. What's the, what's the other dimension me got that I don't have? These underground mines run right to the factory. If you take those mine parts, you will end up right underneath it. Now, if, he, if he can control an army of evil robots, then so can I. You know, I'm because I'm him. I'm, you know, I'm, I'm better even. Hey, hey, tough girl on the monitor. You don't think I'm evil? I'll show you guys that that him me is a hack. Me me will totally rule this place better than he I was did. That, you know. Robots attack! Doofenshmirtz is out. Peace. Would you care to stay for dinner? We're having roast beef.